In this video, I'll explain how to do gasless token transfer. Let's say that Alice has 100 DAI and Bob has 1 ETH. Bob tells Alice, give me 10 DAI. Alice agrees, but notice that she doesn't have any ETH. So she says, I can't, I don't have any ETH. She cannot send any of her DAI since the transaction fee is paid in ETH and she doesn't have any. Okay, but there is a way for Alice to send some of her DAI over to Bob without having any ETH. And this is done by what's called ERC20 permit. The way ERC20 permit works is as follows. So just like before, we have Alice with 100 DAI and Bob with 1 ETH, and Alice does not have any ETH. The basic idea is that Alice signs some message, gives it over to Bob, and then Bob sends the message over to the DAI contract, executes some transaction, and the DAI contract will allow Bob to pull some of Alice's DAI. So the first step is Alice prepares some message. In the message, Alice will say something like, I approve Bob to spend 10 DAI. She would sign this message and then send it over to Bob. Bob would take the message and the signature sent over from Alice and then send it over to the DAI contract. The function that he will call is called permit. By calling the permit function, this will let the DAI contract know that Alice approves Bob to spend 10 DAI. After Bob calls the function permit, now the DAI contract knows that Bob can spend 10 DAI from Alice. So next, he'll call the function transfer from, transfer from Alice to Bob, 10 die. 10 die will be sent over from Alice over to Bob. So now Alice's balance of die is 90 die, and this 10 die will go over to Bob. And since he was the one that executed the transaction, he will be paying for the transaction fees. So now his ETH is, let's say, 0 0.98, 0 0.02 for the transaction fees. And this is how Alice can send some die over to Bob without paying for the transaction fees. But now let's say that both Alice and Bob do not have ETH. Then how would they be able to transfer the token from Alice to Bob? So let's imagine a case where Alice had 100 DAI and Bob has 0 ETH and also 0 DAI. Alice wants to send 10 DAI over to Bob. How can Alice send 10 DAI over to Bob without neither of them having any ETH? To do this, we'll need someone else that has ETH let's say Carol, and we also need a contract that will send the die from Alice over to Bob. Let's call this contract gasless token transfer contract. Let's say that Alice wants to send 10 die, and the first step is Alice prepares a message like before. Alice says, I approve the contract, this gasless token transfer contract, to spend 11 die. Now Alice wants to send 10 die over to Bob, so why is she signing for 11 die? Well, since Carol is going to be the one that's going to be executing, she doesn't want to execute for free. She wants some of Alice's die. So the one die will go over to Carol for the transaction fee. Alice signs this message and then gives it over to Carol. Carol takes this message and signature and then execute a function inside the gasless token transfer contract. The gasless token transfer contract will call the die contract, passing the message and the signature. And it will call the function permit. So this permit will approve the gasless token transfer contract to spend 11 die from Alice. Next, it will call transfer from. It will transfer from Alice over to the gasless token transfer contract, 11 die. 11 die will be transferred over from Alice over to the gasless token transfer contract. Bob will receive 10 of it, and Carol will receive 1 die. This will be the fee that she gets for executing the transaction on behalf of Alice. So at the end of this process, let's see how much DAI Alice has. 11 DAI was transferred over from Alice over to the gasless token transfer contract. So now Alice has 100 minus 11, which is equal to 89. How about Carol? Well, Carol executed the transaction. So let's say that the transaction fee is 0.01 ETH. So now she has 0 0.99 ETH plus 1 die. And Bob? Bob would have received the 10 die, so now he has 10 die. And this is how Alice can send 10 die over to Bob without neither of them, both Alice and Bob, not having any ETH. 